guys, what's up? It's Laura from Laura Marie Plans, and today I'm here for the start of my March haul. Um, I have some planner stickers, some foil, and some kits from some of my favorite shops to share with you guys right now. It has been like a week into March, and I already have quite a bit, but y'all know I have been working part-time and trying not to spend all my money, but we'll see how long this video is, and that will be the real judge, I guess. So I have some Crest Press, some SPC, and some Planahanna stuff. So I'm gonna get started with the Planahanna stuff. I am a PR girl with Hannah. You can use my code Laura15 to save 15% off or mention me in the notes. By the time you see this, I may have a new freebie, however. Um, but this is my current freebie and it says bloom and grow with some daisy flowers and some script self care and plan. And this is actually in lavender hollow and I just did a whole lavender hollow spread. So I definitely could have used this, but I will save this because I already have a lavender hollow spread that I know I can use this, uh, for in April, I believe. And then this was the February freebie, I'm assuming. And it was a full, box like a full solid box and obviously this is in her cheetah or leopard pattern um the scripts say good day sunny day celebrate and then you have some cute flowers and then into what i ordered i also got a super cute journaling card with her on it so i did get some stuff that unfortunately is not happening in the near future anymore, but I was supposed to go to Florida for my mom's uh, rocket launch. That was supposed to, supposedly supposed to be her last one, but it has now been delayed because something's wrong with the rocket. So we don't really know when it's happening, but I will, I am going on that trip to go see my mom's last rocket. So I am going to Florida. I am hopefully gonna go to Disney and all that, like I've been talking about. Because my mom does plan on retiring after that rocket trip, rocket, rocket trip, rocket launch. So I want to support her because she's been working at NASA like her whole life. And I have only been to like one other space shuttle launch and it was very traumatic because I hate loud noises. And I was a kid, but I'm hoping to go in full support this time. So I got these custom scripts in her font choice nine, I want to say. It is so freaking cute. I need so many more stickers in this font. And I got this because I thought it was space. It would match. I got the planet underlays preview previously uh, to go with this and then I got these as well but I was going to use a um, caress press kit I had in mind like the beachy space one because we're going to Florida for it at Cape Canaveral so I got these custom scripts again not I don't know when I'm going to use these you'll eventually see them in the lineup but I'm sad because I was supposed to go in April so I got these but these are my custom scripts and then I got some quotes. So I got Kate Canaveral, Florida. That's my mama and happy retirement mom. Long story short, basically you'll see these eventually again and uh, that is that. And if you have no idea what I'm talking about, just disregard. I got overcooked scripts because I've been playing that with Jake as in I played it once clearly. No, I'm kidding. I think I used it other times um, or I, I played it other times. I just didn't have these scripts yet, but I have been into Overcook, so I've been playing that. I got these custom scripts because I actually fast forward into April, which is kind of a while from when I'm filming this right now. But by the time you guys see this, it will already be April. So I got, um, I'm planning on using this kit, the March Mystery 2023, which just came released at SPC again, like it like the collection came back to shop because it's been a year but I'm planning on doing Lavender Hollow so I got these custom scripts because it is Thai New Year and this gives me total Thai New Year vibes um so I got Songkran 2024 Happy Thai New Year Songkran Festival in Sawa Di Pimai I don't know if that's right but I don't know um which means Happy New Year in Thai so I got that I got these olive headers I feel like I'm taking forever to explain all this for this kit, which I'm no longer using this week. You guys will see the kit I have, but this is getting kicked out of my planner, but I got these olive headers to go with it. And I hope to use this kit when I visit my sister eventually, because she does have a farm. 
but who knows? And then I got, oh, these olive overlays are also for that kit. Let me stick this in. I was gonna do like an olive and matte bronze moment. I still am, but I'm just hoarding this kit. And then I got some of the Pokemon Catch Em All. Um, so I got the overlays in Pixie Hollow. And then I love this washi. I thought it was cute. And I want to use the Pokemon kit. I have the Pokemon kit from SPC and I want to use that. It's actually on the floor because the album fell. So let me pick that up. It's right here. Um, I was hoping to use this. Jake has actually been playing Pokemon like competitively with his friends. I have some other stuff to the Pokemon bundle from Planner Choco, but I was hoping to use this for my brother-in-law's birthday in May. I think it may be the same week as Mother's Day. So I don't know what I'm gonna do right now, but I potentially have this and for some reason it like won't go in. Oh, okay. Wow. That washi just like got super ruined, but I'm just going to stuff that in there like that never happened. Okay. Anyway, that is that from Planet Hannah. That was like such long explanations, but here we are. Okay. I have an order from SPC, which this is a small order. Um, so I have her journaling card, which is super cute. And then she's giving lots of freebies. So I got this silver heart washi some gold drink doodles, some silver wedding doodles, and some rose gold wedding doodles. And then I just had a small order because I was obsessed with these. Um, Kahlo, uh, she asked like four suggestions for these and I was thinking before, I don't know if I commented it, but I had thought before that hollow ones would be so good because I love her glitter ones. So I just got the sheets that I tend to use most just because I don't find myself really using the big bundles and I'm trying to save money. So that's sheet nine, sheet five, sheet three, sheet two, and then I got two of the Scribbler Girls. So I'm really excited about those. And then I did get some reading scripts. Um, because I have been into reading, which is weird. And I never thought I would say that. And then I do have two kits here. So, um, these were two separate orders from Cross Press. I've been really on a tight budget y'all. So like, sorry if there's not a lot of content, but, uh, I say that as I bought myself a St. Patrick's Day and Easter kit and needed neither. Um, so this is the freebie. I love this green color. It's so pretty. I just got my nails done green like today and I'm like, what a perfect day to start my March haul. But I feel like they're so bright. I would have much preferred my nails like this color. Um, but you have St. Patrick's Day, camping, spring cleaning, happy Easter, spring equinox, spring forward, and some doodles. And this was my St. Patrick's Day kit I got. I haven't done a St. Patrick's Day kit in so long but this kit is just so darling and cute like this kitchen scene with the checkerboards the rainbows this freaking couch with the lucky charm pillows is such a dream the cereal the the cookie charcuterie board I just saw this and was so like obsessed like I had to get it I had to get it and so I got it and I have foil coming from Plan With Me stickers, I believe. Oh wait, this is definitely a new format. That's cool. Is the rest new? Did I not notice that? I don't know what she did, but you get way more. Oh yes, you get more of the big labels. I think she took out some of the little things. I honestly don't know, but I love this format because I love having these um, quarter boxes and then I love having these big labels. So I'm really excited about that. And then basically this bottom washi just sold me. I was like, I need it. And then all it took was plan with me stickers to come out with a Lucky Charm foil bundle. And I was like, yeah, basically I need it. So this is the extra box. I got the green washi. Again, this is the green I wanted my nails to be, and this is the green they are. Um, I thought this yellow extra color was super cute, so I wanted to add on that. And then I got the medium, medium skin brunette add-on girls 
um, which are super cute as well. So that is going to be my, I mean, you guys might have already even like seen the play with me right now by the time this goes live, but I feel like this year is just flying by, but that is the St. Patrick's Day kit I was enticed into buying. And then of course I was enticed into buying this. And then she released a different art from Painted Lilacs, which I'm just obsessed with Painted Lilacs because we have something really fun in the works coming, which might already be released by the time this video goes up. But um, she released that Easter kit and I want that one more, but I think I'm going to use, get that and use it for something else and just not use the Easter boxes because they were add-ons, but I got the same freebie. Caress Press has just been killing it. And for me, I got pink tie-dye from Planet Hannah and possibly Plan With Me stickers. They both have it, so I don't really remember which, but I thought pink tie-dye would look so fun with this and I love a pink tie-dye holiday moment. I love using pink tie-dye. I thought this bunny was super cute. I thought the ice cream and the scene was pretty and these colors. I'm like a sucker for pink and orange. I ended up buying the, I don't know what SPC called it, but like the love spell kit or whatever. I love this new format. Um, with the pink and orange Sadie Piper's designs art, which you guys will probably see in this haul as well, because I just love pink and orange together. And I was like, I got such bad FOMO of people using that kit um, this February and I didn't get to. So um, I got the black haired extra girls, which I love both of these girls. And then I got the extra color and the grass bottom washi. So foil for both of these kits will be coming very, very soon. Hopefully, I believe they are both shipped, but that is that for this portion of the haul. Hey guys, I am here for the second portion of my haul. I have a lot of stickers. It has literally been like less than a week since I last filmed my last clip and I'm kind of shook how I have so much, but I do have a planner face order, a SPC order, two Planner Hannah orders, as well as a Plan With Me stickers order. So I am going to hop right into this. Oh God, she always, like, she is the most generous person ever. Her, um, I think her PR applications are actually closed now, but I highly recommend being on Erica's PR team. Um, she's just simply amazing. So this is the journaling card you get in all your orders. This is my freebie, which I'm absolutely in love with. This actually looks like it's in her, it's either sparkly green or, spark I think it might be sparkly green actually. I'm doing a sparkly lemongrass spread right now. So I was like, should I add this? But I am also doing a sparkly green spread um, later this month, which it will now be April when you guys see this. But this is my current freebie, which will have been gone by the month of April um, passing. But you have representation matters and all you need is love. And I just think that's really cute. Um, this is the February 2024 All Orders Freebie, which is so cute. It says you're looking absolutely stunning today. And then some scripts. I got this productive me time self-care and take it easy. This is the March 2024 All Orders Freebie. So she preemptively included this, which is super nice. Oh, sorry. This looks like it's in some blue foil. This looks like it's in her like hot pink. And you have March, April, Hello Spring 2024 Bloom. Some icons and then this really pretty floral box and then I'm obsessed with these um this is in her green hollow which I do have a spread um and some of the stuff is in here it's actually the week I'm currently in St. Patrick's Day um but I don't know if this will really go with the art but these boxes are just so cute and this is the February 2024 $35 plus order freebie and even though this is my February order you can, she puts her freebies live in the shop and you can later purchase them, I'm pretty sure. So you can go look these up and get them still, which I just love. And like these are not normal sheets that sh are in her shop. They're like exclusive to the freebies. So then you can purchase them later, which I just love. And then this looks like it's in like oil slick or something. I'm absolutely obsessed with this foil, whatever it is. Like that is beautiful. I think it looked really pretty with the um birthday queen part two art from or part three art, I guess, from Sadie Piper's designs that 
I got from SPC, but this, you have a tall box. It says, let your soul shine. You deserve happiness and one day at a time. <clears throat> Sorry, excuse me. This is the March 2024 $35 plus order freebie. So she um, is very ahead, obviously. And these are little Easter doodles, which I can definitely use. This is the $50 plus order freebie. And this looks like it's in just a regular green and you have some floral boxes. This is the $75 plus order freebie. This looks like it's in gold and you have date covers, date numbers, stars, and whole reinforcers. And then you have the $100 plus order freebie, which this looks like it's in sparkly gold. It's really, really pretty. But there's almost like lines in this. Like I wonder if some of these are new foils or I'm just like clueless. I don't know. But you have a bunch of these like gardeny growing quotes that are super cute for spring. And then into my order, those were literally all my freebies that I got, which like I said, she is just super, super generous to her PR team. So I got, I kind of want to show you guys like, Okay, let's do the doodles first. So I'm so excited about these. She released new um, custom doodles. So these ones are the safari animals and these are so cute. You have like, I don't know my animals, an ox, a cheetah, elephant, lion, hippo, giraffe, flamingo, zebra, crocodile, alligator, hyena, monkey, a yak. I actually don't know if that's an ox. Let me know what that is. Um uh that looks like the guy from lion king what is that called a warthog a snake a rhino an ostrich and then it repeats and y'all know i love the hippos i literally scream that she came out with these like these are probably some of the cutest hippo stickers i've ever seen i got a very modest two to start but i'm going back for more because i love hippos with my whole heart um okay so I basically just got like two spreads worth of things. So let me pull out my spreads, my kit lineup organization, and then everything falls. So the week I'm currently in, I am using this kit. Um, and I was talking to Erica, I don't know, like Green Hollow is definitely not the best choice for it. We need like a nice pastel minty green foil. Does that exist? Um, so it's St. Patrick's Day, the week I'm in. So clearly the green doesn't really match, but I don't know. I don't know. It's not terrible. It's just a lot more yellowy. So anyways, I have, I got scripts. And I feel like I'm probably gonna use it. But anyways, my whole vision here is there's like a big Lucky Charm emphasis in that kit, which the plan with me for that spread should probably be already up. So you guys would have already known what I end up doing. So I'm not gonna waste my time on camera deciding right now, even though I want to. But this is the Lucky Charms foil bundle in Sparkly Hollow. I was like, I for sure wanna get Sparkly Hollow to go with that kit. It's just so cute. So I was thinking like this over top and then like doing the green. I don't know. I've also never gotten um, like solid boxes before. So this is kind of cool. It's so foily. Um, but yeah, so I got all this stuff to, I have to decide like really soon. Um, but I got all this stuff for potentially the week. I feel like I should have just done like gold and or something I don't know but here I am do I think it matches perfectly no I think the sparkly hollow looks good but I'm still debating on if I'm using all of this stuff so I did though pick up the St. Patty's overlays volume three I liked the um this box that's why I got it um the my multi custom that I just put my custom words in and this is in I don't know what font choice this is in but I was really into this font lately and I want to change it up. And then I just got two of the solid underlays and those are all in green hollow. This is a freebie I got for my last order, but I'm gonna keep this out because I kind of need to figure that out like this week, which really stresses me out. I hate not knowing like what I'm gonna do. Okay, 
sorry. I'm like all over the place now. And then for this, I have, do I have this in my lineup yet? It's the Pink Diamond Planner Co. December Mystery. I wanted to get Gold Hollow to go with it. The kit I got didn't come with foil because uh, I bought it from someone. So I just got the Gold Hollow tie-dyes to go with it, um, tie-dye underlays and some scripts to go with that kit, which is in my kit lineup. I will show you guys just in case you have no idea what I'm talking about. And it's in the front, which makes it super easy. This kit I thought would look really cute. There's some tie-dye elements as well. So I don't know yet when I'm going to use this, but I'm definitely going to use it this year. I just don't know yet when, but it will for sure be in my one of my future lineups. And then I have two Plan of Hannah orders. So this one I got first. I've been obsessed with Plan of Hannah. You can always use my code Laura15 to save 15% off or mention me in the notes to get my freebie. This is my freebie. I got a white one, which is really fun. And it says bloom and grow, self-care plan, some daisies. And then this is, um, I think the February all orders freebie, which is a solid box. Good day, sunny day. Celebrate in her um, February February font of the month, and then some cute daisies. And then um, you do get her journaling card with her on it as well. So I did get some scripts. I got. I've been into reading, but I only read Fourth Wing. And then sorry, an airplane is passing by, but I'm just going to keep talking, hoping that you can't hear it. I read Fourth Wing and I have yet to, I read some of Iron Flame, but I'm just not as into it yet. I'm not like a big reader at all, but I was like, I need these because if I do read, I need to mark it. I had nothing to mark reading because I literally have not read since Harry Potter. And like, that's the only thing I've read since like high school when I was forced to read books. Um, it's actually funny because Jake and I started hating books together the same year, sophomore year of high school in Honors English. We hated it because our teacher, we like her now because she like grouped us together and that's how we met. But like she was kind of evil and that's why we hate reading now. It was just like our school had too much pressure and like it was just not, not fun. That's why we're not living in Maryland anymore. Anyways, I got these. Um, you have start new book, finish a book, DNF a book, book shopping, and then a bunch of reads and like some stars to rate it. I got just the regular reads. And then I got this um, in no foil. This was her February font of the month. And it's like little balloons. I didn't know what I was going to use yet. So I just went ahead and purchased that um, or what foil I was going to use. So I was just like, I'll just get that for whenever because I can always use non-foil scripts. And then I did get my Laura 2 foil bundle um, that is new to this term. I'm absolutely obsessed with this. And she had the brilliant idea in one of her vlogs to get it in hollow flower, pink hollow flower, whatever it's called, but it definitely has those three words in it. Um, I highly recommend, I think someone actually got it like on the vlog or maybe she recommended it. I don't know. But people have definitely purchased it in this. And I'm like, oh my god, it's so good. So I got, this is my foil bundle. You have the daisy headers, some icons. These are the scripts I chose. Um, They're pretty just like generic. I didn't put anything like specific to me if you're worried about that. Because I want anyone to be able to use it. Like there's no dog stuff. Um... I'd say the most me thing is like the boba, but like who doesn't love boba? You have date numbers, uh, date circles, and some corners. These are the boxes I chose. So you have some heart um, overlays, some confetti, a stroke box, a double stroke box, a you got this. And it just looks better and better as you keep flipping through the pages, like the, the flower heart hollow flower hollow, flower pink hollow, whatever, is so beautiful. You have grow positive thoughts. Um, This is the washi I chose. I actually need to, oh, you can really see the flowers here. I actually need to message her because I want to see my next foil bundle because I think it's going to look amazing. Um, And I'm really excited about it. I used all my Laura One foil bundle like throughout the whole month of February. So if you want to see that, definitely go check out literally like any of my plan with me's. But do you guys see this? Like, I don't know if you can see the glisten on camera because my lights are really bright on my phone. Yeah, you can. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? This is amazing. So I was thinking with this kit, 
I could do it with this spread, possibly this. I was thinking might be fun. So I think I might do that actually. And I was planning on using that kit sometime in May. So that will be in my May lineup. Um, okay. And then I have my second order here from Planahan. I feel like this is a long haul clip, but hopefully that's a good thing for y'all. Um, not for my wallet, but for y'all. Okay. So I saw in her vlog, she's been including like these die cuts, which are really cute. I got a mac and cheese one. Um, this is my freebie again. This looks like it's in lavender hollow and it says bloom and grow. I already explained it. I'm not going to re-explain it. This looks like it's the February freebie in blue hollow. And then I did order. If you order on Mondays of her treat week, she usually has another bonus freebie she'll throw in if you order the Monday of her sale. So I highly recommend because this is like three boxes plus a bunch of deco, which is super cute. And this is in her leopard foil. So this was the bonus freebie. I don't, I couldn't tell you which week it was, but highly just recommend um, getting your carts ready and checking that out the day of so you get that extra freebie i got this dementor journaling card as well so i think she changed it up and then i got so i got some scripts here i got challenge i'm obsessed with this new i think it's font choice nine and i was like i need it so i got this because i love watching the challenge i got traders because i've been watching traders well the season two ended but i want to watch season one because i'm like super into it and then love is blind i've just been obsessed with and then I got some Asian food scripts for me so these are all customs by the way um but you can literally get a custom in whatever you want and these are all in bot choice too so I got hot pot poke Japanese barbecue Korean barbecue and pho and then I got all of this to go with my Easter spread which I have the kit here I think I hauled it maybe last clip I don't even know now but I was thinking pink tie-dye would look so good with this so I got my my scripts um the only thing I added I didn't even add a happy easter am I okay like seriously am I okay because oh no I did I was gonna say like that is not like me um I got oh I got two did I order two I don't know um I got two of the Easter eggs because there's not much Easter elements in this kit really besides the bunny, but I was like, I'm gonna bring it in. I got the confetti washi, the fine confetti. This is one of my favorites. It's just perfect for like the second washi piece as a minimalist piece. And then I got the Easter eggs. And again, this is in her pink tie dye. It's like pink, orange, and silver colors. I have used it many of times and it's one of my favorite foils. I think the last time I used it was like, um, Thanksgiving or something or like the week before Thanksgiving and then I got the Easter quotes because I want to embrace that Easterness so I don't I'm not like religious or anything but the I feel like the holiday kits this year were just out of this world good so I was just like I'm going all in so that is everything for Planna Hannah next I have oh god the camera is shaking Next, I have SPC. So, okay, wait. Let me not show you guys my invoice. Okay, perf. So, these are the freebies I got. Um, definitely recommend checking out SPC. I am one of her, like, Scribble Squad members. Um, so, yeah, just really excited about that. This is really cute. This is like a silver script freebie and it says with my love, girls night, bestie date with BFF and with BFF. That's so cute. I haven't seen that before. Um, you have a sparkly hollow Lux freebie, a silver freebie and um, this is like travel, hiking, etc. freebie. I haven't seen this, I don't think. I wonder if these are new, but this looks like it's in gold. So those were all my freebies as well as the jur the farmer's journaling card. Bentley, can you stop grunting? Because like I'm trying to film. Okay, 
I got the doodle color. This was her doodle color 100. It was her final one where she was doing it like that format. So I wanted to go ahead and pick it up. I thought this gold would be super versatile. I, I didn't get all the sheets. Now she has them in the shop where you can get all the sheets, all 15 sheets. She may change them up. She's not going to add more, but um, they stay in the shop. So like you can go pick up the one she released two weeks ago still now instead of just that week, which I actually prefer because I got to save my money sometimes and buying every week isn't really feasible for me, which is why I haven't been buying all the doodles. I've just been buying the sheets I really like. So I have sheet nine, sheet five, sheet four, sheet three, and sheet two. Those are my personal faves. I really just look at the doodles that I already have and just look at the sheets that are most empty. Ideally, I would love all the sheets. So I am glad she's doing that bundle now available whenever. And then I have the Scribbler Fam 4, two of those, because I'm just really into those. And then I did get this foil bundle and I was like, for a second, I thought she threw it in because I didn't remember buying it, but I do remember buying it now. And this is the Shattered Blue. And I was thinking, what you guys will see this, my April lineup will be up around this. I was thinking of using it with, let me show you guys, this kit, which you guys will see what I end up choosing. It's kind of a little more brighter, but I already have, like this one's a lot darker. So I was thinking about using it with this kit because I have some plan with me stickers stuff, but I still wanted like a full on bundle. So I'm thinking of using this. I thought it was really, really pretty. So yeah, I got that shattered blue and confetti to go hopefully with the walking in the rain kit from Caress Press. Um, but you guys can see my April lineup for what I end up deciding there. It should be up around the same time as this video as it usually is. But I have that and then I I love this art so much I love that Sadie Piper released new colorways this is literally two out of the three colorways I purchased I contemplating purchasing the other one the Easter art but pink and orange are my two favorite colors they have been my two favorite colors for so long and when I saw a pink and orange version I was like oh that's good but then I saw everyone's foil with like the sparkly orange and the sparkly magenta hollow and like everything the possibilities are endless so I got enticed to buy this after Valentine's Day because also this engaged box is so cute like if you don't if you're single buy this because trust me you need an engaged kit I did not have an engagement kit back when I got engaged I used a really cute art that I was saving because I kind of had a feel you kind of get that feeling um unless it's like completely out of the whim which could happen too but I got that feeling and I wish I had an engaged box and I thought this is so cute like being engaged ugh, being engaged is like so fun like I love that part of life but these patterns are so good these colors are so good I love this like satin or not satin like silk almost I don't know I just thought it was so good. I saw everyone use it and I really was just like, okay, so I'm either going to use this for an anniversary or next Valentine's Day. I don't know which. I might use it for an anniversary because we have both our dating anniversary and our wedding anniversary. It sounds crazy, I know, but like if I have a beautiful kit to use for it, then why not? Or I could use it for my engagement anniversary, but that I'm not, I'm, I'm joking. I'm not going to do that, but like if you wanted to, like I'd say if I was still engaged and not married, I would consider that and put this engaged box on our engagement anniversary because that's cute. We got engaged August 8th, which is a lucky thing in like Chinese culture. And I love that he did that. So anyways, you get these um, extra boxes. I got the fashion girls. This is uh, the fashion two girls and then I did get the doodles because why the heck not which I think with her new release she also released a sheet two of doodles which is really exciting so you get even more options dude I don't I don't oh it's my bubble tea okay let the dogs out is that mine oh they gave us all cheese 
Mm. Pretty good though. Well, the dog's out. That's so good. Don't eat mine. Oh, baby. I got eight, you got four in your stuffed bread. That's so good. All right, Jake just brought me the new like cheese puffs from um Little Caesars and we have a Little Caesars right by us, but we did get it delivered. Not gonna lie, but it's freaking incredible. They just like released them in March. So definitely go check that out. Anyways, last thing I have here. I think this is the last thing. We somehow made it through. I got this planner face mystery kit. Um, so my friend Laura Rose Plans, she posted this mystery kit. She like posts some of the kits she gets in the mail, which I just love on her feed because I love just seeing the different art. So this is one shop that I'm newly trying in March um, in terms of like purchasing. I have another shop coming as well, which I'm excited for. The mail should be here like within the next week or so. But this is the Planner Face Let's Potty Kit. This was her December 2023 mystery and y'all know. I love my dog. I love parties. I love my dog's birthday parties and I always go all out. He has had an incredible birthday party in the dog park the past two years. I actually don't know if I'm going to do something this year, but either way, I need a kit to celebrate him. So for the freebies, you do get this card. I actually purchased another kit from her too, which I'm really excited about. So it may or may not be in this haul. If not, it'll be in April. Um, this is the February freebie, which is like greens and I love the bunny, really cute. And then I did get this, which is so cute. I'll probably put this in my planner actually. It's a little birthday dog with the pink stuff. None of these dogs in this kit look like Oliver, but I really don't care. Like that's really gonna be hard to do. So let me show you guys the kit first. Um, this is, this paper reminds me of like Fox and Cactus's paper. Like it's like premium matte, but it's like really thin premium matte, which is fine. Like I don't really do much. I just don't like regular matte, but the rest I'm like fine with. So, and I don't really write, but I'm pretty sure my pen would work on this anyways. So, um, cause I use so many script stickers nowadays. So you do have enough boxes to just go all dog or all cat in this kit, which I love. If you are a only cat person or like me, only a dog person, I personally don't like cats. So I'm not going to use the cat boxes, but I did count and you have plenty of just dog boxes. So I love this scene here. Like that is such a vibe. The dogs with the party hats, the cake. It's so cute. I'm pretty sure Coffee Monsters Co. Coffee Monsters Co? No, Coffee Doodles Co. Coffee Doodles Art did this kit too. I'm not 100% sure. I love this box with like the heart and the tail and the like charcuterie dog board and then this way to the potty. And I love these colors because I feel like you can really use it for a girl dog or a boy dog if you're like into color, gen gender colors, which I know some people aren't, which is fine. Um, Oliver personally he's a boy and he wears all pink and people call him girl all the time but I don't care because he can be whatever he wants he's a dog <laughs> um this is the bottom washi sorry I'm just like playing around so it looks like you have like another strip here and then these are like little things and then these are like strips of washi glitter headers labels more labels and a like thin piece of glitter which is cute I haven't seen that before these patterns are also really, really cute. And then you get scripts, some of these square boxes, some of the bigger labels, some doodles. I really like these too. I think these are really cute. Um, and then the birthday dog and cat. So that is just the kit itself. And then I don't know, I haven't purchased one of her regular kits. So I'm not 100% sure, but if this always comes with it. I think this kit was more expensive though, so it came with more. Um, I think normally you'd have to like add these on, but you do get four tall boxes and two are dogs and two are cats, which I just love. I love that. I got the bottom washi with the little 
paw prints. I got this little doodle sheet with the weekend banner, the doodles, some deco bits, and some check boxes. You get more boxes. I love these ones here. It'd be perfect for a quote. Plan With Me Stickers does have really cute dog birthday quotes in her shop that I think would look so cute. Definitely let me know what foil I should use with this. I was thinking of like a sparkly blue or blue hollow because like reminds me of Oliver. Oliver was named Blue Boy when we got him. So yeah, but these boxes are all super versatile. And then you have a cat box and then you get more fashion boxes. So you have like the darker skin tone with the heart and then more cat boxes. And then yeah, that's literally it. But I was so happy about this kit. And I started immediately looking for another kit. And I luckily got it even though it was sold out on her shop she like messaged me so i'm really excited to get that kit it's the cyber monday mystery kit from last year and i'm planning on using it for jake's birthday so she has some really really good art and stuff and i'm just really excited to be trying new shops and whatnot so that is everything i literally have so much stuff it's actually crazy um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this portion of the haul and thank you guys for watching. Okay guys, I'm here for the next part of my haul. I don't know if this is the second or third clip. I have my first ever order from Liner Designs and an order from Crest Press. So first I have this kit from Liner Designs, which is basically why I made my order. I was obsessed with this art. So I did get a journaling card. I actually saw this art and it's super, super cute as well. Um, she has like a kit based on like a Disney movie marathon. Um, so that's the journaling card. I did get these elephant and otter characters. This is so cute. It's like a girl and boy elephant. Um, I got some scripts and then I placed uh, my friend Jen on Instagram and YouTube, Jen Joy Plans. I placed her notes or her name, sorry, in the notes to get, or I think I used her code actually um, to get 15% off and get her freebie. So this is why I purchased the kit. I was obsessed with this art and I am going to use this this year for May the 4th. Um, I always love to use a Star Wars kit for May the 4th. I don't always, I did it last year and don't know if I've ever done it uh, other than that, but I thought this art was super, cute and well done so i did get the add-on girls um i got this girl because she had black hair the other girl has brown hair and then there's a cute little cake and then this is called the force i just thought this was really really cute you have like bba you have like ewok or chew or chewy pancakes and bacon i think it's chewbacca the millennial falcon pancake a Java the Hut cupcake. I love this R2 D2 popcorn bucket. It looks super cool. I love R2. He's my favorite character. You have the same girl here um, that you get here. I love this pug in the Darth Vader costume. I think that's hilarious. The scene is super cute. Um, and then you have another BB-8 and some sushi Star Wars stuff and then like lightsaber chopsticks which are super cute. I've always wanted to get um, my dad those or Jay because I thought those are funny. You have like a um, Death Star globe and I just thought these colors were super cute. So I ended up purchasing navy underlays and foil from Planahana as well as Burnt Senna. Um, is that how you say it? I don't know. Um, from plan with me stickers in her star format so I think that'll look cute with this because there's definitely stars throughout and I'm doing like a navy and burnt senna moment that's going to be in my April um lineup video but I don't know if the foil will be in because I kind of ordered this kit super last minute and that's on me, but that is going in my April lineup, which will be up around this video um, this month or this week. And I have foil coming in for that. And then I also got another kit that I've wanted for a while and I was like, I should get this uh, just because if I, um, if she ever like discontinues it, then that's on me for not getting it. 
Um, but I love this art. These arts are both by Clip Art Designs, who I think does phenomenal art. Um, this is a safari themed, and y'all already know why I got this. I will get to it eventually, but I have 8 million hippo kits at this point. I didn't have this art of the hippo yet, um, but this version that Lynn, is that her name? I don't know, but that Leonard Designs did um, was my favorite because you have the hippo in its own box. The other boxes I saw, like the hippo was like behind and I obviously wanted its own box. And then I just got the fashion add-ons. My absolute dream is to go to South Africa and go on a safari one day, but that is super expensive. So I'll just keep dreaming. And then I had some kits from Caress Press. I actually bought this kit and thought it was like exclusive art. I was so excited. And then people were like, when I asked for foil, people were like, oh, last year I used, and I was like, last year, what? And apparently it was a mystery, but I'm obsessed with it. So um, I got this same like green freebie that's spring themed, her spring sampler freebie, as well as this, which looks like a really cute foil bundle coming out. Excited to see that. Um, when I'm filming this, Caress Press is actually having a spring sale and y'all already know I'm going ham. I've been obsessed with Caress Press. So this kit is free people. Um, I thought this was really cute. I am not a Western girly by any means, but this gave me more like boho vibes, if anything. Um, and I was just really into this. So I think I'm going to use bronze from um, Plana Hannah with it because that's what people told me to use. Um, she has the Moo underlays that I think would look really cute. Like I love this paisley pattern. She does have paisley underlays so maybe I'll do that. I used to love paisley when I was in um, like middle school. I got this tall girl here, this extra box here, this extra box here, and then it came with this living room scene which is honestly absolute goals and then I did get the extra washi in the cow print because I thought that was really cute so that is free people I'm probably going to use this in the fall like I said I don't know if I said that um but I thought this kit was going to sell out so I jumped on it I don't think it even sold out <laughs> but I don't even think her kits sell out like I think she keeps really good stock but I was so excited by that art and then I was like, oh, it's been uh, released before. And then painted lilac art, love her. Emma and I just had a fun collab as in all I did was submit my ideas. I didn't do anything else, but we came up with, mainly she came up with a really fun AAPI Heritage Month kit uh, to use in the month of May and Caress Press just released art for it today. So I'm going to definitely purchase that today, like literally today. But I want to also get this uh, kit because I thought it was so cute. Um, Caress Press had like an Easter add on. Had I known, I would have definitely rather used this Easter kit than the one I'm using. But I think I'm going to use this in like June or literally anytime in the summer. I love the golden retriever and I love the food boxes. Um, I love this bedroom scene. It's just all so cute. The Stanley cup, the flower, Ollie literally has this in a toy and the colors were just really, really pretty. I love the pattern. So I thought Emma did an amazing job uh, with this and I've been loving, I love this extra box with the strawberry cardigan. I've been loving Cross Press's new format. So I'm really excited about that. For the add-ons, I got the washi. You do get the alternative skin colors with that box there that I was just saying. And then I really like these girls here. I got them both in black hair and I thought they were super cute. So that is everything for this portion of the haul. Um, and yeah, I will maybe see you guys in my next one. If not, thanks for watching. Hey guys, I'm here for the final portion of my March haul. I feel like this was a rather big haul. Uh, editing Laura will obviously be able to see, but <laughs> I'm very sorry to my wallet. Um, so I have a Plana Hannah order. I have a Carly Plans order. I have a Caress Press order, as well as a Planner Face order. Again, it's been, I really feel like this has been a thick haul month, which... I know some of y'all may love, but my wallet and my husband do not. 
Um, so this is an order from Planet Hannah. Um, if you don't know, I'm a PR girl at Hannah's shop. Um, you can use Laura 15 to save 15% off or mention me in the notes if there is a sale going on. So this was the little journaling card I got. She always writes your name. She's been doing these like decals lately. Um, she, I watch her vlog, so I know, I always know what's going on. I'm a nosy girl. So, um, I got this little plant reading a book, which is super cute. I did ask for Andrea's freebie because I just recently finished fourth wing in February and I was like, this is just like a fun, cute little freebie. So this looks like it's, it's in a really pretty foil. I don't know what color it is, but it's honestly like a perfect, like periwinkle. And this is like a, um, fourth wing inspired freebie from Andrea. So it says a dragon without its rider is a tragedy. A rider without their dragon is dead. Finish fourth wing, finish iron flame, and then some books. Um, this was, um, I think the March. Is it March? I don't even know what month it is anymore. All orders freebie. You have a box that says today is full of possibility and then some date scripts. And this looks, yeah, this is obviously March. Am I good? Um, This looks like it's in pixie red. Then we have my freebie, which again looks like it's in pixie red. This is my current freebie. I do have a new one coming very, very soon. Um, So definitely grab this one while you can. And this one says bloom and grow, self-care plan. And then you have some daisy and then I did get some scripts I got TikTok binge in her font choice nine which has become a new fave of mine I realized I didn't have any TikTok binge scripts and I really need some so I have those um I got this in the same font choice nine in lavender hollow for my Thai new year spread which you guys will see in my April lineup um but I got some extra scripts here that say song Kron and Thai food Thai temple, etc. I got this in navy to go with my May the 4th spread. This will also be in my April lineup. Um, so I got some other scripts here like May the 4th be with you, Star Wars movie night. I usually do a Star Wars movie night. I also did a Cinco de Mayo script um, because I know it is the day after Star Wars day and then I have just like a random Star Wars but um, yeah, I usually just like exchange. I don't really know what I exchange. Like I'll just exchange, like sometimes I'll put like just Jake, just Oliver, and I'll usually take out those ones that I don't use as much and put in other things if they're applicable. I got the, um, little icons in Navy as well for Star Wars. And then for my Thai New Year spread, I thought these last dragon overlays were so cute. They're actually pretty easy to miss a lot of her cute uh, pop culture stuff on the shop because she can't have the like these pictures as like the main image because Shopify is weird and annoying. I don't know the details of it, but I'm pretty sure that's like basically what the thing is so I clicked on this one and I was like yes I need it I love her with like her hat and the cape and then I love the little rolling potato guy named Tuk Tuk um I don't know is rolling potato is definitely not an animal but you know what I mean um so I'm gonna use this in some of my Thai New Year spread that this doesn't go like I'm, I'm not using a Raya Last Dragon spread if you're curious I would love a kit um inspired by that but I am doing a different kit so this may or may not I mean it's probably not going to really match but I'm going to throw some of it in just because I thought it was cute and represents Southeast Asian culture and then I got these to go with the same spread um my Star Wars spread with the kit that I showed you guys previously from Linner Designs so I got the Galaxy 2 overlays in navy and then these and then I did get some stuff in Burnt Senna which will have to be in the next portion of my haul um but that is from that's going to be from plan with me stickers and that will be in my um may the four spread that you guys will eventually see um eventually so then i have an order here from carly plans i haven't placed an order with carly plans for a while but i definitely really like some of her icons and some of her particularly her like duo scripts are just still one of my favorites so I really did want to stock up so I got the sea loves planning freebie I love Camilla she's one of my friends on Instagram and YouTube and so I wanted to put her name in the notes to get her freebie and support her um I got this cute little journaling card I got the um, March 2024 freebie, which is super cute. I got the $15 plus freebie, which I 
love that she has a Passover script because I need that. And the open window is so relatable. I've been opening my windows lately when it's really nice out and it's just, it's such a nice feeling. And then this is the exclusive colorway for the month of April. And this is the $30 plus freebie. And then into what I got. So I got some doodles. They're all gaming related. So I got the Animal Crossing New Horizons handheld. If you've been watching my plan with me's in the month of March, you may have noticed I have re-picked up Animal Crossing and have been going on pretty consistently actually. So I wanted some more doodles just to mark that. And these ones are really cute. You have the little switch as well as the little like Animal Crossing leaf. So I thought those were really cute. Um, I do get most of my doodles in just the like um, one where you can get pastels, neutrals, and brights. I'm pretty sure those are her three colorways or whatever her colorways are called, but you get a mix of all. And I love that she offers that. I got the Sims Plum Bobs because, well, I am doing a Sim spread, uh, very soon. It's actually probably going to be up around the same week or around the same time as this, uh, haul if I have everything going up when I am supposed to, but I have been loving the Sims. So I wanted some of those. And then I got more toads because I love everything Mario, Mario Party, Mario Kart, Mario Golf, you name it. I love it. Um, and then I got some scripts. So I got Animal Crossing again, been really obsessed with that. I, this is just like, this is one of her OG font duo things like this was her OG font duo and it still is literally my favorite TikTok binge told you I needed more of those okay I'm filming for a little okay meetings because I've been having so many work meetings lately and I just needed more scripts to market run errands I noticed I didn't have just like a neutral run errands script so I wanted these YouTube binge I love a good YouTube binge. I got lazy day because I have lots of lazy days because I'm a lazy person. I'm a cancer. So I'm like a sloth. Um, but I thought those were cute. This one's in her like font choice four, I think. Organized stickers and sick AF because I do be getting sick with my job. So that is everything from Carly plans. I really love Carly's shop and can't recommend her stuff enough. Um, and then I do have two orders from caress press I don't know why I stumbled I feel like I have most likely had a caress press um haul bit in every one of these hauls like is it just me or am I obsessed with caress press lately but can you really blame me so Sadie Piper Designs released this new art y'all know I was obsessed with it y'all already know so this is um the groovy vibes only kit I actually feel like my new foil bundle from Planet Hannah that will be coming out I don't know when the new PR team starts, but whenever the new PR team starts in April, March, January, February, March, April, May, question mark, uh, whenever it does or April, I don't know when it comes, when it starts, but definitely check that out because I feel like that will go with this from Planet Hannah. But I also just love this kit so much. I got the black hair tall girl, the black hair, I don't know, other girl, the deep skin black hair girl, and I got this bottom washi. And this is the other sheet. Um, it also came with this sheet as a freebie, but I just love this. I already did buy sparkly orange to go with this. Um, I think olive would also look really nice. Like olive and sparkly orange would honestly be crazy. Um, but I bought sparkly orange. So yeah, I feel like there's just a lot of options for this. I think Planet Hannah has confetti orange, so similar effect. These are the freebies I got in my order. I got um, this fairy tale freebie, which looks really cute. And this is the spring sampler freebie. And those are both in champagne lights. And then this kit was her March mystery kit. And y'all already know why I had to get this. Like, do I really need to explain myself? I am hippo obsessed. I have loved hippo since I was a little, little kid. I literally have over 250, like 250 to maybe 350 um, stuffed hippos between my parents' house and my place here. And whenever anyone who knows me realizes sees a hippo, they think of me, they send me it. Like most of my DMs are just hippo videos from people. So I literally have this exact hippo just saying, uh, I sent it, I posted on my story and sent it to Maggie and she was like, did you win it at a fair? And I was like, no. Um, but it, the chances of me having the stuffed hippo in a kit were pretty high. So I don't feel like that's saying much, but I basically got this all for the hippo, but obviously it was so cute too. Like this is just such 
cute art. So I wasn't mad about getting it that I ha I was forced into getting this because of the hippo. Was I mad? No. I was very glad a hippo was included so that I could get this. Also, color blocking this with the yellow add-on um, and like rainbow would be a vibe. This is the add-on. I did purchase this um, in her shop and I'm not subscribed to her mystery currently. So I was very happy that this became available and I hopped on it right away. So that is my caress press order. I have another big caress press order coming because she had a spring sale, which y'all know I went crazy on if you follow me on the gram. Um, but yeah, she had a spring sale. So I, of course, bought a lot more. So definitely look forward to my April haul. Just keeps piling on. And then from Planner Face. So I got my first Planner Face order. Wasn't that in this haul, the dog birthday? Or I'm pretty sure it was. And I posted that I really wanted um, the Cyber Monday mystery in her premium matte paper full format or whatever this format is. And she messaged me that she actually had one left. And so I jumped on it and got it. Um, I was like, yes, I need it. This just totally gives me vibes of Jake. He's such a gamer. I'm kind of a gamer too, but I just really liked this. I thought it was really cute. I love anything gamer vibes. Um, if you can't tell from all my, uh, caress press doodles i am quite the gamer now and jake is too so i thought this would be a good kit for him or you know whatever um this is the march order doodles i got this really cute happy birthday vinyl cake decal this is um the thank you card and thank you so much. I don't know her name, but thank you so much for like messaging me and telling me about this art. Also, um, Laura on Instagram, she also was a big reason why I got into Planner Face because she posts like pictures of the kits. Anyways, I'm going to stop yabbering and just show you guys the kit. I think the colors are really, really fun. The only thing is Jake is more of a green guy. But I feel like this is just really cute. Definitely let me know, like, what foil you guys think I should do with this. I mean, obviously pink, blue, and purple hollow. But if there's, like, anything else, I thought this was funny. I paused my game to be here. That's such a that's such a gamer thing. Um, so, yeah, I just thought this kit was really cute. I would ideally like to use it uh, for Jake's birthday. But... I don't know like if some if another kit is gonna come out so I don't want to say that yet because it's literally not till September um but for now this is what I have slotted for that so that is everything for this portion of the haul as well as the whole haul in general I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed this make sure to like comment and subscribe follow me on my planner instagram at laura marie plans and I'll see you guys in my next video bye